I think visualization is is one of the biggest things in the game. I mean, you know, the majority of your swing takes place without you being able to see what you're doing. So for you to be able to see what is happening behind your body, behind what your eyes can see, and to be visualizing it is is kind of is the focal point of having great technique. And so, you know, a coach can tell you, hey, I want you to do this back here, but unless you can visualize it and see what um, see what's going on back there on like a video or with this product, then uh, you know it's tough to do. You know, and as a coach, I, I tell my players all the time, hey, I want you to do this behind your body, and they think they're doing it right, but they're not because they, they can't see it. So I think the visualization part is is key. It's huge, and I think your body, after seeing a you know, a swing correctly over and over and over will adapt. What I do with my kids when I'm teaching is I have them, you know, close their eyes and try, after they hit a good shot and try to visualize it or, you know, try to do, you know, shadow swings where they're not even hitting the ball so that they're able to visualize these things. And this product takes it a step further where you're pinpointing what exactly you need to do. You know, it's repetition, which is the name of the game. And, you know, I think that the two, you know, the application of watching the, the video and the repetition of watching, you know, the stroke over and over will transfer over into, uh, you know, you playing good tennis. And you know, it's it's, it's going to be it's going to save you a lot of time because you're going to, you know, in your head, you're going to be seeing it over and over and over. And then when you get on the court, the you know the learning process is going to definitely um, be a little bit quicker.